Hello there! Displaying a product list is a crucial aspect of any website online store. In this video, we will guide you step by step through the process of creating a product list using Vue.js and Laravel API. Vue.js is a progressive JavaScript framework used for building user interfaces, while Laravel is a powerful PHP web framework that is widely used for building robust web applications. By the end of this tutorial, you will have a complete understanding of how to display a product list on your website, so let's dive in. We will now start working on this tutorial. In CMD, I will create a Laravel project. I will open it with Visual Studio Code. Next I will install Vue.js into the project with commands like video, you can follow it. To learn the details of installing Vue.js on Laravel, I have a separate video on this, you can find and watch at my channel. Here I will do a quick installation of Vue.js on Laravel. OK, I will create a home component and embed it in the welcome blade. I will embed Bootstrap and Fun Awesome in the Welcome Blade. Now I'm going to write HTML CSS for the product listing.
I will create a database and a products table for storing data to display. Here I have prepared some pictures of the product. In public, I will create a folder images and copy the image here. I will insert some sample products into the database. OK at Envi will change the name of the newly created database. I will execute query using Query Builder to get all products and pass data to Welcome Blade. At the welcome blade, I will pass data products to the Vuge's component. This is a view. JS component that defines a prop named products with a default value of an empty array. When the component is created, the created lifecycle hook is called, and the function attached to it logs the value of this products to the console. The purpose of this component is likely to render a list of products based on the product's prop passed to it from its parent component. By setting a default value of an empty array for products, the component can handle cases where the prop is not passed or is undefined. This code is a view. JS template that loops through an array of products and dynamically generates a card for each product. The generated card includes an image, name, price, and a button to add the product to a card. The V for directive is used to iterate through the product's array and generate a card for each object. An M tag with an SRC attribute that is bound to the product. Image property is used to display the product image. Two P tags are used to display the product name and price respectively. OK, I have finished getting the product data to display on the screen with Laravel and Vuges. Hello and see you in the next videos. Goodbye.